The most powerful part of our channel management is a series of API integrations. With API integration, bookings and guest information are pushed into OwnerRes automatically from the channel, just like a direct booking from your website. This video will walk you through the process of connecting your OwnerRes account to the Verbo API. Please watch Connect APIs Airbnb for instructions on API connecting to your Airbnb account. The first step in connecting your OwnerRes account to your Verbo account is to configure the Verbo API integration rules. Go to Settings and under the Channels section, click on API Integrations, then click the Connect Verbo link. On the Verbo Channel Setup page, start with a Credit Card Payment section. First, decide if you'd like to accept instant bookings or prefer guests' request to book. If you select Instant Book for your Verbo, you must also select one of the Instant Book options for your Airbnb API connection. If you select Request to Book for Verbo, you may use either Request to Book or Instant Book for Airbnb. Then, decide if you want your security deposit to be shown as a part of the guest charges or prefer it not to be displayed in their total. The option shown will not add the security deposit to the guest total. Since this is a refundable item and is not an actual cost of the booking, showing it in the total may make your listing appear more expensive. Sometimes the guest credit card will fail. If that happens, the OwnerRes system will automatically send them a notification and ask them to use a different card. It will also place the reservation in a pending status. In this section, you can choose how many days you will allow the booking to remain pending before it cancels. We suggest you leave the message set to the system default. Finally, if the booking is getting ready to cancel for non-payment, would you like to let the system cancel it automatically, or do you prefer to receive a notification so you can reach out to the guest? If you'd like to limit the time frame a potential guest can book through Verbo, use the Booking Window section to do so. You should already have your default arrival restrictions configured in your Properties, Rules, Booking Window. If you are happy with your defaults, you do not need to do anything in this section, i.e. leave lead time and max days in future to use the Properties settings. The next section covers the Cancellation Policy and House Rules. With Verbo, you have the choice of using one of their predefined cancellation options or writing your own. Use the drop-down for this field to select the policy you prefer. House rules are a very important part of your Verbo integration. The contents of this section will transfer directly to your Verbo listing and it will be displayed to potential guests. You should use this section to advise guests of your most important rules, particularly those which might result in a charge to the guest. Should you ever have an issue with a guest where you need assistance from Verbo, your disclosure in this section will be one of the things considered by Verbo. And, as you'll notice, they don't give us much space to write rules, so you need to be concise. After completing the house rules, you may select which rental slash legal agreement to display to potential guests. We recommend you stick with the default shown. OwnerRes will automatically generate a copy of your renter agreement. For some listing channels, you may decide to increase your rates and surcharges above what you are charging for a direct booking. In the Rate Adjustments section, you can choose to leave the rates the same, increase just the nightly rent, or increase both rent and surcharges. You also have the option to decrease rent and surcharges if you prefer. The email option, which is checked by default, indicates whether or not the OwnerRes system will automatically send booking confirmation notifications to guests. We recommend users keep this checked and consider creating a Verbo channel template. Finally, there are several other options. You can choose to include reviews that you have received or will receive from direct bookings, subject to Verbo's policies, and have them sync over to your Verbo listings. You can then choose if you'd like damage protection to be applied to Verbo bookings, and whether you'd like the location of your property shown on the Verbo map at its exact location or an approximate area. As with booking window rules, if you're happy with the selection you made during the property setup, you may just use the property default. Account name can be set if you need to customize what is sent to Verbo. If not specified, the name shown in gray will be passed over to Verbo and your listing needs. Don't forget to save. Once you've done the initial setup, you can always make changes by going back to the Verbo channel page and selecting the Change button at the top. Reference the Policies tab at any time to verify your rules and policies are configured how you need them to be, whether at the channel level or the individual property level. Now it's time to map your properties. This is how OwnerRes and Verbo communicate, so Verbo knows which OwnerRes property matches with which Verbo listing. On the main page for your Verbo channel, select the button to change property mappings. On the next page, you will see a list of all properties in your OwnerRes account. For each property, fill in the Verbo listing number. After entering the listing number, make sure to check the boxes to include each listing in the Verbo API integration. 
start the Verbo API integration process. Unlike Airbnb, the Verbo API integration is not fully automated. Verbo still has to go through a manual process on their end to activate the connection. For this reason, you will probably see your listings disappear for a couple hours or maybe even a couple days. And if it doesn't appear to be working after 48 hours, please let us know so we can follow up. Make sure you've run the listing quality analyzer and cleared any errors. Verify that all your Verbo iCals are already included in your settings calendar import export. And remember, if you do not have a credit card payment processor active in OwnerRes, you will not be allowed to connect the Verbo API. On the main Verbo channel page, select the Instructions tab. After making sure you have completed the first two steps under Setup Instructions, you will see your OwnerRes user ID account ID. Click the Copy button next to the ID before you begin the connection process and click on the words to start Verbo API integration. This will take you to Verbo.com where you will follow their step-by-step -step instructions. All the info you need can be found back on the OwnerRes Verbo channel page. If you run into any issues filling out the info for Verbo, you can contact Verbo PM support at pm-support at Verbo.com or call 877-239-2592. There's a lot to know about API integration. Please see ownerreservations.com slash support slash articles slash channel management API integrations for more info and answers to any questions you may have. Thanks for choosing OwnerRes.